Sorry, guys. I had to do it. It's like 3 in the morning. Just got back from the little late night cruise. But we got to unbox this, dude. This is the Motordyne Art Pipes. And we're just going to check to see that everything's all right. I should have probably done this earlier, but ah, I've been super busy. Ah, work, family stuff. Make sure everything is in tip top shape. I ordered these guys through uh, Dialed In Racing. Uh, they are a certified distributor for Motordyne. So you get the, I think it's a three year warranty for this exhaust. All cushioned. Uh, tension, do not flow exhaust gas through the Motordyne exhaust system until verified correct fitment. Okay. We got some uh, sweet stuff. I guess there's some instructions. I think there's a little stick on there. Motor dying. Bubble rat. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, it's so cold. It's not too bad. I'm really wondering what the difference in weight is between. Uh, what this exhaust setup is compared to my stock. Getting rid of the cats. Adding these art pipes. And then the shockwave titanium exhaust. There. I kind of don't really want to remove these out of the bubble. They're sitting there pretty nicely. That's everything. Oh, we got the tools, gaskets. Right there. What? They give us a license plate too. Like a license plate holder. Man, this is the suction cup, guys. That's not really sticking too well. I gotta, I gotta clean the surface. This is just sitting on the wood table here. And, um, it's falling twice now. We got this guy. True Enthusiast Performance Products Mortar Dye. You sick? Okay. That was a little surprise. I like it. No free advertisement for them as well. I think this is just all cooking. Pretty cool. This is on top of that. All right. probably weigh these and see what they all weigh. I don't know if my scale is going to hold it, so I'm going to probably have to just get on a regular scale and then just subtract my weight to get the weight of each of these, which should be like the same. Instructions here. So we got 
about this guy. Motor nine. I guess that's the length. I thought maybe it'd fold out a little bit more. No refunds, exchange, returns, or replacements on used products for wrong products installed or and or installed incorrectly. <coughs> so it's got the number of each. Um, each of these. So we got... Two gaskets. So we got two of these. Oh shit. Damn it. Alright, that's enough of this GoPro. You're falling too much. Dime art pipe installation. Um, you're gonna just two of these, just in case I lose one. Terms and conditions. Why are you just give me two of these, just in case you got two a two person job. Booyah! You got. Two instructions. Um, I feel like I'm missing. Never mind. Gasket. I thought maybe to bring another bag of these, but this is just it. We got two. Because I have MD001 and MD00. Oh, this is the HR. This is the DE. I'm surprised they put both of them, but they just probably print a bunch of these sheets off. So I got the DE, and this lists the quantities. I got two of the gaskets, um, ten bolts, ten flange nuts, one instruction sheet, one warranty sheet, one detail. Although I think I got... I see they're different. Is one uh, the DE, one's the uh, HR. Look exactly the same. So maybe they just gave me two of these. So, uh, for return purposes, I got to keep this box. All returns must be approved by Mordine with an RMA star. Or RMA hashtag. All returns must be in the original box. No returns on used or damaged products. All non-defective returns are subject to 20% restocking fee. Warranty. Um, many parts are for off-road use only. That's because you're getting rid of the cats, like the exhaust. But for this state, there's no <coughs> smog regulations. So we're okay with that. As with any race activity, there are risk performance risk at performance modifications. All installations are the customers on risk. Motor die engineering engineering holds no responsibility, either implied or otherwise, for mechanical, electrical, or other failure when using aftermarket performance products. Some items listed are illegal in many states and are only for racing vehicles, which may never be used on public highway. Uh, warranty policy: Motor Dine Inc. Warrants to the original retail purchaser and the Motordyne product will be uh, free from defects in materials and workmanship for one year from the date of original purchase, except for full stainless steel exhaust and piping, which are warranted for two years from original purchase. So, two years, these are one year. Right? No? It's full stainless steel exhaust and piping. I don't know. I guess this would include the two years as well. Uh, this warranty does not apply where the product is purchased from an unorthodox 
unauth unauthorized Motordyne dealer, so that's why I made sure I got them from Dialed and Racing. They were really helpful. I'll probably do a review on them as well. Um, the reason I went with that was uh, the shipping. I got free shipping, and um, they did a lot of discounts and answered all my questions. were really friendly, very helpful. Um, and I think I just messaged them through uh, Facebook Messenger, and they replied pretty quickly to all the questions. And they had a really good uh, sale going on for their exhaust parts. I think everything was like 5% off, um, as well as like marked down already. So just like the cheapest and most helpful. And so kind of like a no-brainer. Um, I would have probably gone with the Z1 Motorsports, which a, a lot of people have purchased um, this exhaust and art pipes from. And so they had a pretty good reputation, so... <coughs> Let's see. Um, more warranty stuff. You want to take a look at that, I guess. You can pause it if you want to read through. So that's that. Try to make sure I got all my bolts. So I'm just going to count everything, make sure I got everything, and then um, I can take these guys out too, but it's just easier because they won't fall out. I can just hold it, but, but you guys probably want to take a look at them, so we'll do it for the video. Maybe it's already opened. It is. All right. You guys are in luck. It's already open. Boom. Order dying. The welds. Sick. It's not for the O2 sensor. Mm, I don't know if I'll need a gasket for that part. That maybe the shockwave one will come with it. Exhaust for that. Pretty sick. Take a look at the other one. So I was reading about the art pipes and why they make so much power compared to like test pipes uh, the I think owner of Boderdyne um, created these guys who was a rocket uh, scientist like I said earlier and he put the concept of so I think it's a German it's a German word I forget what it exactly is but uh, so like the bottles that you like you blow into it and then make that sound it's the same concept with these art pipes where air goes in, swirls around, and creates like a vacuum, and then it gets pushed out faster. Uh, oh, that felt weird. That felt like it was not attached. Maybe I'm just hallucinating. Felt like that weld wasn't like this piece was separate. Cause that's the last thing you want is a exhaust leak. But it seems like we're good. I was just panicking for a second there. All right.
Okay, so that's the uh, Motordyne art pipes. <sighs> Stay tuned for more. Hopefully we'll install it tomorrow. If not, these babies will wait and you'll see uh, some more mods later. Thanks for watching. Pieces.